Hello, this is Bini here. Today, only one thing, which is to talk about Hang Seng Tech. As of the time of recording now, Hang Seng Tech is already up about 3%. Initially, it was led by Li Auto because Li Auto today went up about 25% because of earning bids and a very good uh, rosy 2024 outlook. But now, we can see that across the board, a lot of Hong Kong shares are actually heading up. And this was actually led by a huge move, a huge rally in the Chinese market. So today, only one objective of this video is the key level of Hang Seng Tech that everyone should take note of. And if this key level is broken, then I think that we're going to have a rally in Hang Seng Tech. We're going to have a reversal of this bearish downtrend in Hang Seng Tech. And I think that we're going to have quite a good move in the Hong Kong market. First, let's roll back into Hang Seng Tech into what happened in early 2024. This was a support level, so that's I marked that in red color. And a lot of people were expecting at that point of time that this support technically would hold. And who knows that price was actually broken. So I think that a lot of people sold out of Hang Seng Tech. Now the thing is that right now Hang Seng Tech is finding another support at this level here. So that's the new support level that's given by the previous low. If price can again reclaim the previous level that it broke, reclaim means that if price can in turn move up above this level here that it broke, then that would be really interesting because it means that people who saw out here would be in a regret mode. They will regret that they actually sold out because right now price is actually higher than what they sold. Now in this case here, the key level for Hang Seng Tech would be 3,580, which is the previous low here. So that's about 3,580. If you like to, you can just round it up to 3,600. Now this means that if Hang Seng Tech can close above 3,600, then this would set it into a bullish mode, it will do a bullish reversal technically for now. So key level to watch for Hang Seng Tech is 3580 to 3600. And what are the instruments that you can do if you want to consider for long term investment or for short term trading? As investors, if you are looking for long term investments, then you might want to consider Lion OCBC Securities Hang Seng Tech ETF. So this is listed in Singapore exchange in uh, denominated in Sing dollar and US dollar. So for the Sing dollar, the stock code is HST. One thing to mention, the weightage of each stocks in the index is kept at 8%. So this means that, for example, if Li Auto is to move up like 25% today, uh, well, because of the weightage, then it is kept at 8%. No one single stock can affect this ETF greatly because the weightage for each stock in the index is kept at 8%. One thing to mention is that it tracks very closely to the Hang Seng Tech Index itself, and you could use CPFs or SRS to invest into HS Tech ETFs. The second instrument is more for short term trading. As you know, that HS Tech is still right now in a downtrend. Uh, if you would not want to consider investing for long term, then you want to actually trade it, right? So, one of the instruments that's listed in SGX is this DLC, which is Daily Leverage Certificate. For example, if you go into the website of uh, UBS, which is one of the issuer of uh, DLCs, then at the underlying, choose HS Tech. And then, if you are looking at, let's say, the bullish side, then choose the daily long and you find that you have four choices of HS Tech DLC to choose from. What I like to do is to choose ETF with a higher sensitivity. So what do I mean by higher sensitivity, right? So this sensitivity means that it takes about 8.3 point of a movement in the HS tag to move one tick in the DLCs. So hence, you would want to go for the one that has a lesser value, which is it takes about 1.53 points in terms of movement for the HS tag to move one tick in the DLCs. Well, this is a short video. The video is to highlight the key level of Hang Seng Tech that investors would want to take note of. Now, usually these technical levels are very important because it's being referred by many of the investors and traders out there. Well, I did a video earlier on uh, HS Tech, um, time to pick low for the Hong Kong stocks. You might also want to refer to this particular video, especially for those who are looking for investment. Well, I come to the end of this video. If you would like me to cover any of the Hong Kong market or Singapore market, do leave me a comment and I'll be happy to cover them. Thanks a lot for your time and remember to subscribe to the channel.